Tomoko has some very bad news for some of you. Now, what does that mean? It means you're being deported. Okay, why are we doing this today? We did a little, lot of research, okay? About, about two months ago, you guys might have remembered um, Superman here. Woo! I tackled this guy in the street because he was beating up his girlfriend. Did you see that video? <laughs> so I got a couple comments on um, one guy named Joe Benes or something. And um, a lot of people asked me about some, another video by Japan channel DCOM who claimed that if you are arrested or involved in any altercation, you will be kicked out of Japan. How do you say kick out? Okay. So I didn't think that was true because, because I, got, I got friends in low places. Mm. I got some low-level friends and they've been in jail. Mm. I got some friends in Japan who've been in jail and been out of jail mm. and had some run-ins with the police. Actually, a lot of them are, are professors at universities. <laughs> mm. and, and I know a guy even indirectly who killed a man in Japan accidentally when he was defending um, a woman. It's a very old story. It happened 20 years ago, here, actually here in Nagoya. Mm. But these people are still in Japan. Mm. So we called the... Uh, actually, I went to Nishiku Keisatsu uh, mm -hmm. about two months back, and I asked some questions right there. It was really loud, so instead of this video, I'm just gonna, we did some proper research. Um, this is what I found out, and Tomoko, please correct me if I'm wrong, because she, she called the, um, the uh, Kokusai Center here mm -hmm. in Japan, because the cops said, just in case, call the Kokusai Center mm -hmm. and ask them, because they have a legal, they have a legal advice kind of center hotline. Mm -hmm. So we did, and this is the deal. If you are involved, mm -hmm. If you are involved in some kind of fight in the street, you will be arrested. This is the Japanese sign for arrested. Hi. Right? Taiho Sarai. Taiho right? Mm. And anyway, you'll go to jail. Mm. Right? And if you're convicted, you will go to jail and stay in jail. If your visa expires mm. while you are in jail, when you get out of jail, you'll be kicked out. Mm. Right? So far? So far, so good? Mm. Okay. Because she did. I did the questions in Japanese, and just to make sure I had the, the woman explain the whole thing to her in Japanese, because it's, it's a lot of senmon yogo, it's a lot of legal mm. mumbo jumbo. If, however, you're in jail, let's say you go to jail for six months and you get out of jail, mm. and your visa has not expired, you can stay in Japan mm. until your visa expires. But if you want to koshin suru, which is renew, mm. so, 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 so. if you want to koshin suru your visa, so that's that's mm. that's 50 50 you may be able to renew maybe not the things they take into account are whether you have maybe uh, business and mm. family if you're married children mm. things like that they probably take that into account mm. the, the woman at the, the police woman uh, mm. told me that it's case by case they, they love to say that in Japanese case by case <laughs> and saiban got so, so the court the court will decide Mm. And, but however, the woman at the, the police woman told mm. me that if it's drugs, mm. you will be kicked out of the country. And a lot of cases you've seen in the media, uh, Paris Hilton wasn't allowed in. Mm. Recently, Katy Perry's boyfriend, uh, Russell, Russell, he was not allowed in. Um, Paul McCartney was kicked out, but was allowed back in nine years later. So sometimes they give you these, like, um, you're on probation for a certain amount of time. You're not allowed into the country for a certain amount of time. However, in Japan, if you are arrested for drugs, mm. you go to jail. So, in Japan, so you get out of you get out say it again. We had to call and they had to con they called the court and confirm this information. You you go to jail for drugs, you get out of jail, and then you're deported. So you're deported. If you if it's drugs. はい、そうです。麻薬の時は厳しいね。オッケー。そうだ、ベーシックリ。ナイユ。あとね、ごめんね。再入国できる確率はすっごく低いって。ああ、そうユキャンゲットインザカントリーアフタードゥイングドラッ